Now, let's go to see what uh, I have uh, chosen for, uh, for Villa Web Television uh, as the best solution for, our, for their goals. And then for video download, uh, I think that uh, they could make use uh, of the broadcast machine. They could create uh, easily a podcast uh, ch uh, channel, maybe also uploading some torrent cast videos. Uh, and uh, with this solution, they won't suffer if there will be many, many clients connected at the same time as happened uh, last days. Uh, I thought that uh, you had uh, some problems with the connection because after the presentation many people connected uh, to your website and the system maybe crashed. If you would have made, if you would uh, have used uh, a Torrenka solution, uh, you won't uh, have uh, experimented such problems. So, then uh, for live streaming uh, uh, solution, uh, if you want just a unicast or multicast your signal through the network. Uh, Without making use of Torrentcast uh, stream uh, technology, you can use VideoLAN client uh, and then uh, implement uh, the VideoLAN client stream uh, into a web page and then uh, using, uh, uh, using uh, a plugin, uh, the user will receive your stream. Uh, or otherwise, if you want uh, to create a Torrentcast live stream, uh, and then uh, you be sure to not to suffer anymore uh, the problem of so many clients connected through your server at the same time. Uh, you would have to make use of VideoLAN client uh, combined to subcast. Uh, this means that you use VideoLAN client uh, to stream the signal from your webcam to your subcast server and then use the subcast server to stream the signal through the network. Uh, as uh, the time was not uh, much, uh, I think I have uh, chosen also some points which uh, can be useful for to continue to work in this direction. And then uh, I think that uh, it could be useful to work more on the video sources. It could be useful also to stream uh, from a DVB card uh, to broadcast an existing uh, satellite uh, channel or uh, to allow the webcam to be streamed also under many different systems as actually I could uh, stream the webcam also under Ubuntu 6.10 but not under Fedora 6. Point, uh, Fedora Core 6. Then uh, uh, free software, we have to work more on free software as, uh, I, as I have seen there are some interesting solutions but actually they can, are not useful for a company such as the yours because the user uh, cannot easily use these uh, products. So we have uh, to work more on usability which is uh, the final goal of every product that uh, has to be delivered from a television company. We have uh, to work on the interface and also on the install options uh, as uh, we need uh, to create very, very user-friendly programs. Uh, then, uh, to conclude uh, my presentation, I, have, uh, I would like uh, to explain how the future is in te of uh, television is not uh, in the actual television system, it is not on in the digital television, but it is through the internet. Uh, as uh, the content uh, will be always available, in prime time uh, it will be every time uh, because all the contents will be always available and so the content provider will have to be sure to deliver good uh, medias uh, to that uh, each product that they deliver uh, is good. And uh, the, as a delivery method for the future, I'm sure that uh, it will be used peer-to-peer -peer delivery method. Uh, as uh, it uh, can, uh, it can, uh, it is good to not to suffer problems of too many clients connected at the same time, and then uh, always uh, the usability. It has to be easy to use and uh, easy to learn a program. Then thank you for attention.